first, let's go to Keynote. You can add this to a presentation or a project you're already working on, or you can start a new project. And that's what I'm going to do. And I'm just gonna use this basic white one. Now I want to delete everything off the slide. So I'm going to tap on each object and tap on delete. Now I am ready to begin my traceover. First, I'm going to add the photo that I want to trace. I'm gonna to go to the plus sign, make sure I'm in media, and I'm gonna tap on photo. Then I'm going to look for the photo I want to trace and I'm going to use this one. I'm going to tap on the little blue dots to resize my photo. Well, while my photo is still selected, and I know because it has those blue little dots, I'm gonna to go to the paintbrush and I'm gonna go here to opacity. So I'm just gonna tap this little bar and make it light enough, well, transparent enough to where I can still see the photo. And this looks good to me. All right, so now I am ready to begin tracing. So I'm gonna tap the plus, and still in media, I'm gonna come to drawing. And you can use any of these tools to do your traceover. If you're using your Apple Pencil, you can use your Apple Pencil. If you don't have an Apple Pencil, you can use your finger. I like to zoom in so I can see my um, photo better and I'm going to use this marker. And remember that if you tap the marker two times, you can change how thick your pencil will be. So that is very thin and this is very thick. Once you're ready, you can begin tracing. This is my finished traceover of James Bowie, who was an important figure in the Texas Revolution. And if you notice, I didn't trace everything. I only traced what I want to trace. Um, so now I'm going to delete the photograph. So to do that, I'm going to tap on the photo and you'll notice you'll have these blue little dots around it and you'll have this black bar come up. I'm gonna choose delete. And now my photo is gone. So if you notice, I have nothing selected. I haven't tapped on anything on the page. And I'm gonna come here to the paintbrush. And I'm going to choose background. And I'm gonna choose image. And then here, change image. You have three options. You can choose a photo that you already have. You can take a photo if you wanna take a photo of perhaps your classroom. Or you can insert from files. That's what I'm going to choose because that's where my photo is saved. And here is the photo of a museum. 